You said it. Maybe that's how it works. The kids control the stories. And they're the wind chimes. You know what that means. Adam Sandler, um, when he walks in at my birthday party, we're not so sure about him. Neither is my brother in the movie. Shampoo and a soap. Hair and a towel. At first, we don't know him, and then we start warming up to him. And then soon, we start wanting him to come to our house and tell us bedtime stories. Get it? Bedtime stories? No? Yes, no? These two kids are awesome, both of them. They're both hard working. They're both having a great time. They love dressing up and doing this stuff. What do you want to kiss my cheek or something? Well, then get it over with. <laughs> oh! <laughs> You're next. Give it. I hated that. Let's see a nice one here. Uh, what you... What's under emaciated? Uh, underappreciated. That's right. You're six. You don't understand words over three syllables. Under. The boy playing my nephew Jonathan. He's a really smart, nice kid and sweetheart. Western. No face necessary, ma'am. Laura is my niece in the movie, and she really is a, an angel and makes you smile all the time. Children, open your books to page 16. Yes, Miss Mermaid. Most of my scenes are really with them. They're very cute and they're very good. They've had pounds and pounds of cereal in one scene. You never had cereal. True. Very true. <laughs> We all got to sit up on this roof for the end of the movie and stay up late and sit in sleeping bags. And they, by the way, have to dress up in all the crazy costumes too, which is really funny. They're so sweet and really cute and very funny. Both of them, very funny. Um, so do you like any of the actors on set? Yeah, pretty much everybody. Russell Brand plays Mickey in the movie and she's Adam Sandler's friend. He's really funny, he's also a comedian. Don't be afraid, don't topple to your death. You've got a lot to give. The Greek was actually kind of fun for me. Russell Brand got to kick us in the face with his tail. That was kind of cool. I keep banging my head. I mean, it's very difficult. It's making me less appealing to the children. We'd had quite a good rapport, didn't we? We were getting on so... Laura, we were getting on quite... Laura, Laura, we were getting on... Laura, Laura. I said we were getting on quite... Laura, Laura said we were getting... Yeah, see, Laura won't talk to me. Jonathan, he's still there. You prefer me like this. Like Jonathan, John, I said, John, I uh, see so you like me like this, right? So, look at that, that kid, that little smile. I don't know how I'll keep my hands off you. <laughs> I'm Jonathan Morgan Height. Girls are disgusting. I kept on saying, girls are disgusting. But it was biscrusting. Biscrusting. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. I want to hear all about this. <laughs> I laughed. Yeah. Hi, my name is Laura Keesling. That's okay. My character is kind of where she's not so sure about everybody. We thought you were supposed to be the good guy. In the beginning, she was really shy, but now she's like the opposite of shy. I'm Princess Leia. <laughs> I return to Earth. <laughs> <laughs> you said happy endings don't really happen. We want our story to be real. Adam Sandler plays my uncle in the movie, and he's really funny. <laughs> See, 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 see. I don't know if we've ever seen Adam this sweet in a movie. And especially when he's with those kids, it's just total magic. You're my children. It's good to have some. You're all my children. You're all my children. Yes, Babu? No, they can stay here a little while, then we'll throw them out. Yeah. <laughs> Very smart, huh? Adam is so good with kids. I mean, just watching him on the set, he makes kids laugh. The octopus can tell you a boy choking me. The octopus. <laughs> He's awesome. He's really funny. So when we have to be like serious, it's really hard for me because he's like, he's being really funny and I can't help smiling. It's really cool working with him. He's awesome. It's actually kind of like hard to uh, not laugh during scenes. Jonathan, in this business, you're not allowed to get tired. In our spare time, we really do a lot of school. And when we're done with school, we like to just play around or we're just, you know, doing something. We can't get really too wacky or anything. 
Somebody threw a fireball at Skeeto, and Skeeto got incinerated. The end. No, 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 no. The story can't end like that. Don't we want a nice, happy ending? You guys are heroes. Seriously, both of you. You did it. Okay, nice having a uh, chat with you guys, and uh, uh, good night. Beep.